Welcome back, everybody, to the red door. Jumping in is Tarnished Samson, the latest addition to the Epiphany mod. Instead of tears, we are going to be using our fists today. Look at all the instructions on this screen. As I hold down the shoot button, we get this charge bar. When I let go, rocks fall from the ceiling. We could pick these rocks up. This is how we will do ranged attacks. Pocket active called Killer Instinct. It can hold any direction and press it to get a dash, which gives us kind of like a uh, Mars type dash. We get iframes with it. And then finally the skull smash. You gotta pick up one of these chunks, press Q on it, and we go Super Saiyan. We unleash a ton of damage, but if we don't do any damage in this form, rumor has it, that you die. So it's risky. Curse of the Blind first floor. Excellent. That's going to be a great start for me. Thank you. Can I use my rocks to break things open? Is it kind of explosive damage? Yeah, I didn't think so either. What if I slam my fists on the chest? The sound effects, though. Let's get some. Bring it on. You imagine punching a fly? I got a rock for your face. I can punch over rocks. Look at me. The skill, though. We have a little charge bar in the upper left. The more damage we do, the more damage we get. You'll notice as it fills up, it'll give you a little pip. We just got one pip there as it looks like a uh, a tooth on a donkey's jawbone. Classic Samson lore. Look at me. Look at me. I'm an expert. You know what? It's time. Super Saiyan. Let's go. Oh, you're in trouble now, monstro. Look at this. Look at this. We are, of course, dealing a bunch of damage. I should be able to not die after this. Yeah, we are fine. We did not die. I don't know how to tell how much damage we are doing or need to do in order to not die in that form, but hopefully we will figure that out. Oh, that's right. We got to do our killer instinct headbutt. How much damage did that do? Yeah, not a whole lot. Probably not worth risking it. Maybe it scales with how many teeth we have on the jawbone up there. How many pips, charges, whatever you want to call them. Seems pretty powerful, but it took us a while, kind of. You know, that probably is the same amount of time that it would take us to kill Monstro as Isaac. Oh, now we got fancy undies that you can't see. That's a shame. As time goes on, our charge bar is being depleted, so we do want to try to do the floors pretty quickly. Backtracking is going to be harmful for us. If I get charges, I was going to punch. I wanted to punch the stonies. That could have been free real estate. Let's get into our curse from first floor here. It looks like I took damage and got a times 1.2 multiplier. Is that what I just saw? So maybe we have like kind of a Samson's Rage thing going on as well. So we get more damage, the more damage we take. Yeah, up to 1.4. Okay. I don't know why I'm avoiding the item room. Monstro's Lung. Does that work? No. <laughs> At least I, I'm, I'm trying to see if like my punches are somewhat different. Uh, I guess it's possible, but it doesn't look like it. You imagine if I was just like like a flurry of blows. You want to do what to my flurry? <laughs> Get it? Curse room again. Oh, this is not fun. No, I made it. Oh, you know what? What if I could kill her instinct in it? Like, I can't. I was going to say I could use my killer instinct dash. I did say it was like Mars. Obviously, it's not that much like Mars. Oh, hey, 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 whoa, 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 whoa. Okay. Pick up the rock, Johnson, and then you throw it. And okay, that's cool. I like that one. Can I bring the rock to my my next room? Totally allowed. This is great. All right, I went from being completely disappointed to pleasantly surprised. I think the ranged attacks are going to be pretty good. So buffing that as such, very very cool. No, I probably don't want that, but I, I have to know. I have to know what it's going to do. Uh, it looks like I just made a range up on my normal attack. Yeah, <laughs> I figured as much. Kind of ruined that one. Well, it was cool for a second. Flatworm, does that work with this? Totally does. It's still kind of cool, but yeah, we, we, we blew it. Tim, why do you have a pentagram on you? Ots, I'm absorbing the souls of my enemy. Uh, you gotta go. What was that about? Was that some sort of special rock that I was supposed to know about? Some secret satanic Tim? Should I be worried? I lost fire rate. I saw, I said damage earlier. When we get the pips, it's fire rate. Maybe the 1.4 is the damage thing. And maybe that's permanent for the, the floor. But yeah, pips is fire rate. Super Saiyan mode, let's go. Oh, he didn't do it. I pressed Q though. Try it again. Q. There we go. Get it. Let's go. The one big problem with doing this 
Whoa! The one big problem, right, is that when it wears off, we uh, lose all of our pips. Let me go back to square one. But it did look like I got iframes through the entire thing. Is that real? You just gonna let me have them iframes like that? <laughs> but more range. Uh, you know, I'm not terribly uh, happy about the range, but I, I guess it is kind of cool to have longer punches. Where would the secret room be? This is the dumbest floor I've ever seen. Thanks, I hate it. I'm actually thinking about going to the shop, though, if I could buy one soul heart to protect my next floor's angel room. Defensive build does make sense. I think that, you know, having a ridiculous amount of damage could be a really sweet way to go with this character, but we're just not getting the health upgrades that I feel like we need, so... After the first two floors, no health upgrade for me usually means angel. Remember, I was like, I'm not gonna try to backtrack it at all. <laughs> Here we are. Oh, wow, these are like bones on this floor? Catacombs? That makes sense. There's floor-specific rocks. I can appreciate that. Wait, I want to get real close to them, and I just hit them with that entire blast. Wham! Feels good. Feels really good. Yeah, my headbutt. It didn't even one-shot a maggot. I'm, I'm a little confused as to the point of the Killer Instinct headbutt. I'm not sure why that was added. Like, it, it's cool, but like, I'm, I'm not gonna use it. This room, by the way, is just cruel. This, this room is cruelty. No me gusta. You took my soul heart. 10% chance for exploding bombs to drop a bomb pickup. Blasting cap. Yeah, sure. I guess we'll go for that. This is a, a risky room for me. Gosh, tiny planet taking away my only range that I had. Uh, oh. I mean, I guess I have the range on my punches now. So, yay. Yeah, that works. <laughs> Knockback. Item room. What do you got? Some juicy sack. Some tarnished sack. I want to do what to my sack? <laughs> Is this funny yet? Gosh, we're not getting any money either. Uh, yeah, I guess I'll try this. I think it drops the stuff that I currently own on the ground. This is not going to be that helpful for me. Uh, I can't even open stuff like we can with Kane's sack. Bummer, man! All right, I'll go for it still. What do you got? Make it worth my while. 10% chance the room clear reward to be a card. Chance for a bonus card from chests. I suppose. We got a high priestess out of it. Sure, 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 sure. Sure, 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 sure. Hot, it's pronounced Worcestershire. You know, like... The, the so Tim, get out of my house. Please leave now and headbutt. Interesting health uh, for money. If I could find any health, the game is just trying to starve me out right now. What? What are you trying to do, man? I can't work with this in this economy. We need something. We need something here, quick. Frail. Got a little bit of a stomp off there. Super Saiyan mode. Let's go. <laughs> Sound effects. Oh, it's so painful when the stuff goes away with the thing. Old bandage. Oh, that's what's gonna be really good for me. Nice. And my angel room. Somehow, okay, you know, that's fair. We technically needed to survive. Kinda wanted an item, though. These rocks have, uh, little halos. Adorable. Just walking up to this angel, just punching it in the face. Just Samson things. Everybody was kung fu fighting. Those flies were fast as lightning. A funny punchy slappy noise. It's just, it's never not gonna be funny. <laughs> you imagine punching a spider and getting some sort of like slappy meat noise? <laughs> that is a meaty spider. Magician. I wonder if I can get homing punches. Try it. Well, they're purple. I'll give you that. That is just those that are homing. But that was actually really cool looking. That looks really good. Tower card up, up and away. Mega fatty, more like mega meat slaps. God, they sound so moist. You have another angel room. Ah, nice. You did it. Experimental treatment. Four up, two down. We got worse. Oh my god. Oh! My damage is 2.3. I don't think I've ever seen worse damage ever. Besides those runs where I had worse damage. Oh, uh, stairway. Very interesting. I will. I'm gonna open up one of these. That seemed worth it. That seemed worth it. I only have one key left, so I think I ought to save it. I got this tough guy. I got a fight with not a fire in the room, which I do like to bring these guys through the fires. God, my damage. Oh, the, the little tiny pebbles that we're shooting out of this now. It's just horrible. Oh, come on. Oh, okay, you know what? You know what? That's it. Bring it on, buddy. You got nothing. You got nothing, because I got it right here. Let's go. Dropping a bomb, too. I punched the bomb away. That's my bad. And now we're back into 
problematic form. Low, low damage, meaty, slappy boy. Oh, stop spawning the kids. Oh my gosh. <laughs> this angel has got my number. You can do this. You can do this. Yowzas! Very excited about the ladder, but uh, I hope we can survive long enough. I mean, got some health here. Can you help me out? Desperate times. Magician, though. Half a soul heart. Okay, that's good. Now, this room is just telling me that there is a uh, secret room right there. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Wait, 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 wait. <laughs> <laughs> I can't stop laughing. Ah! Well, we found the secret room, but I can't stop laughing at the stupid sound effects and just slapping things around. That's basically what this is. At 2.3 damage, they're no longer punches. They're just like little baby slaps. Go in. Get away. Uh, shop. You were supposed to save me. We were brothers. Anakin. Bro, what am I gonna do? I'm gonna die right here? <laughs> my juicy sack got them all hung up and got caught in my goo. Secret room. What the hell is that? I don't want to spend all of my money. I need that for the stairway, but five cents to drop a dice capsule. What is that? That's a D12. Are there any rooms with some rocks I could reroll? Yeah, this one, I guess. I got some cash for it. Well, that was at least interesting. All right, one more. D100. I mean, I would consider because we have some garbage, but we just picked up the stairway. So I'm gonna wait. I'm gonna hold off on that one. But my health though, ah. I'll panic use the capsule D100 if I take one more hit of damage, you know, without getting more health back. If I'm at half a heart, you know what I mean. Item room's got just crap. Oh, nice. There we go. Stare away. Stare away. Stare away. What do you got? Purity and divine intervention. I think I'm going to take both of those, actually. This one giving me some damage. Yo! And then double tap shields. That could be really cool to punch behind the shields. Love it. And then you get one of those. I can't believe that I don't even have an active item. I've not even been inundated by crappy active items, and I still don't have that many good things. Shop Scott's... Demus Salius. I will take a little late, but there's a reroll machine, so if we can get rich on this floor, maybe we can get some good stuff. Oh my gosh. The spiders. The spiders. No, we got a, a speed boost now from our aura. We're back to 2 3 damage, y'all. Item room. Best bud taking damage spawns the orbital. Yeah. Yeah. Feel like I'm inching closer and closer to just popping this D100, you guys. Let's at least try to make it through a few more of our stairway angel rooms before we get rid of our ability to just get an angel room every floor. The stairway is overpowered, but we are just so crappy right now. I'm trying to show off this new mod and the game just gives me a giant pile of poop. Bring it. I don't even have to hit you in the back. That's how strong I am. You got nothing. Bone heart tears up. Okay. Oh, I don't have any money. I don't have any money. I don't have money. That's going to be problematic. We do have the steam sale now, which is really good, but we are going to need some cash if we want to buy stuff in that angel room. There's some money. <laughs> Look at this. This is silly. Multi tool opens most doors and chests, nullifying the price for opening them. Sure. Oh yeah. Oh, good freaking hit. Bye bye, Bone Heart. Oh, look at this though. We got purity, fire rate boost. It's soy hands. You got nothing. You have nothing on this. Everybody was kung fu fighting. <laughs> Stairway, help me. Help me! I'm gonna do myself a favor and just go ahead and drop the D100 now. We're good. We're cool. Let's go. Seven damage. And now we have homing rock shots. Okay, still took damage. And we lost our... We, yes, fine. Maybe we lost our angel chance there, but we gained... Uh, it, shut up. Bro, I'm at 18 damage right now. Get it. Oh, wow. The size of those rocks. Tim, I said get out of my house. Well, I blew my damage upgrade because I went into my curse room, but I did get a potential health upgrade out of that. Bro, I'm in love with this homing shot. It completely nullifies how balls the tiny planet is for me. I totally forgot that I got the shield. We gotta use that more often. There's really no reason not to just spam that as much as possible. Oh, shield is a second too late. 
What is that? Turnover, spawn a shop based on the current room's type. It's tarnished keeper's item, I think. Turnover, can I open a secret room with that? I don't know what, what was that? Can I buy a bomb? Oh my gosh, okay, so I can, okay, I can get stuff. Pretty silly to consider using that since we want our money for the stairway, but I'll hold on to it. Okay, I won't hold on to this eternal heart though. Not using my super saiyan mode as much. Uh, I'm a little worried about being reset on my fire rate, but let's maybe try for this mom fight with our newfound damage. It could be really good. What is this? Consumes three of the pickup type Isaac has most of, can drop random pickups or essences, can spawn glitched gapers, can trigger random active item effects, can add or remove random curses. Wow, I need this money. I, I, I need the cash. Old bandage too, this is gonna be a good setup. Remember I said maybe I'll get rich? Well, here we are. I might play this guy too. See if he can give me some health. That's what I'm talking about. Hey, GB bug. You change this trinket into an empress? Yeah. Item room's got daddy long legs. We're almost spider baby. Was there a filigree feather in the, the, the entire time and I just didn't even notice? When did that drop? Oh man, good thing I backtracked. We're pretty set then. And then we're gonna kill our instincts. Super Saiyan mode for this. Try to grab me. Try me! I feel nothing. Okay, I feel stuff now. Hang on. Going Polaroid here. Next floor. This is where it gets interesting. We're going to here. Definitely, definitely gonna be buying some wafer. Definitely, definitely going to be bombing this with filigree. With filigree feather, angels will drop an angel item instead of key pieces. Try Saigon. What do you got? Weird, okay. It kind of looks like they're starting in front of my face and then veering around, possibly due to Tiny Planet. That's cool though, I like that the most. And if I wanna spend 12 cents, you see there in the upper left, I can tithe and get even more stuff here. Salvation, Isaac is surrounded by a halo. Enemies that stand in the halo for too long are hit by a cross-shaped beam of light. This could be good for a melee build. And now we have flight, excellent. Because I'm feeling spicy, I'm gonna go ahead and spend 12 more cents to get another tithe shop, which is going to give me a load of turds. I can't even afford the next stage, so never mind. This run is so much better, so much better than how we started, it's not even funny. Oh my God, is that a, what is that? Is it a cyst, is that a boil? It's my boil now, want some? Wow, that is really powerful. Let's do it again. Oh, that's glorious. Everybody was throwing vaginal cysts. Those boils were fast as lightning. Now you don't like this version of the song? You you want me to stop? Immediately? I bet that was a little bit frightening. <laughs> oh, I am so loving this rock throw thing. Handy box. What do you want from me? That's, those are nice things. If we really wanted to, we could turn over inside of, ow. Inside of a secret room and potentially get some cheap secret room items to buy. I think it's really costly though to turn over in a secret room. Let's just maybe use my moon card right now. Find the secret room. It costs 10 cents. We could do this, especially if we get some nickels here. Oh. All right, impress me. I am not impressed. Try it again. What is this card? Two of spades. You want to bring me through what that does? Amount of owned keys is halved. Bombs and hearts increased by a third of the original number of keys. That is very interesting. But also, no thank you. Go. Um, we're just, just not getting the stuff. That's a Yara. Bomb this guy. Get the money in the ground. Yara that money. And the cards. Pick up this trinket. Get more money. What, what card? Reverse Chariot, not interested. I'm spending all my money that I could be using in my Angel Room, but I think if I turn over one more time, I might be able to get a good item. I don't have a gambling addiction, you have a gambling addiction. Shut up, comment section, you don't know me. Can someone give me money? Take Boil, go to Boss Room, throw Boil, Profit. Another Angel Room, and a Jesus Juice. Very fitting. Damage, can't grab it because I'm holding onto this Boil. Let's do this first then. 
<laughs> oh no. Genesis, that's amazing. <laughs> I'm out of money, right? We could get more money. I could use more turnover. Super cool item. I like it a lot, but uh, it's Genesis. Do I need to reroll every single thing that I have? No, but do I want to? No, but do I think it would make good YouTube content? Yeah, we can wait. We can wait. Let's get to the chest and then we will do that. This is going to get out of hand, said Huts in every single Isaac episode he's ever recorded. Habit? I can't say no, especially if we're going to Genesis this thing. What's my motivation to say no? We have so many angel items. We're probably going to be guaranteed to get Godhead Sacred Heart back anyways via Genesis. For those of you who don't know, when you use Genesis, it takes you to a special room slash floor thing. It takes away every single one of your items and then it gives you one choice from three for every single item from the corresponding items pool. So for example, it will take away my Sacred Heart and give me a choice of three angel items to pick from to replace it. But Sacred Heart could be replacing Sacred Heart. Rinse and repeat for every... So oh no! You are the worst person that I know, game. You are a horrible person. I cannot believe you just snuck a tick inside of me when I have stairway filigree feather that is unacceptable. Oh my goodness, I didn't see it coming. It was, it was like they're kung fu fighting. Those cats were fast oh. as lightning. Deal with the devil. Let's go, let's see what's up. Yeah, you're a bunch of garbage, but I think it's pretty much my last chance to get something and we're gonna Genesis it anyways. Seven cents to get a book touch. Only 13 cents. Oh, that's okay, yeah. We took pound of flesh, so shop items now cost health and this technically counts as a shop now. Yeah, right. I'm cool with that, thanks, bye. That was beautiful. Did you see when I threw this thing through the prism? Wow. Let's see me do it again. Wait for the prism to go around and go. Wham. Holy moly. Almost got him in one go. Finish him. We made it. Let's take all this stuff here. Go up into this area. Buy the thing. And then we Genesis. What are we going to get? So every single thing... Besides the Polaroid, taken from me. Choice of three per. Active items would be a mistake, I think. I'm gonna stick with the flight here. Fire rate. Oh, we can see what tech punches are gonna do. Okay, a little ring-a-ding uh, of laser shots there. <laughs> okay, rocks are just, uh, what, ethereal then? then? What's up, buddy? Yeah, no, you're not in my way. You're not in my way at all. This is great. Yeah, you, know, you want to lay on the keyboard. Oh, perfect. Yep, that, that's good. Hmm. Let's go habit. Oh, you gotta drop drop the rock. Swarm. I gotta say, maybe, maybe old bandage in this one. Oh, cricket's head. Damage upgrade. Oh, revelations. Holy brim. Probably damage syringe. Fat odd. Another, oh, hey, sacred dice. I don't know how that would work with re-rolling things in this room. It could potentially eat every single item, which would completely lock us out of getting the rest of our stuff. I wanna actually do an entire video on sacred dice, so I'm gonna say no to it for now. Yeah, we'll save that for later. It's really good, it's really good, but I'm not ready yet. You're not ready, the world isn't ready yet. Broken modem. Oh yeah, homing baby spoon bendies. Go with all stats, hey. Halo. Um, yeah, I'll, I'll do a dark bum. Stairway again. We might get another stairway. I don't remember how this works. Purity was just so good, though. Probably not going to get another staircase. Let's be honest. Eyedroppers, personal favorite of mine. Soul or damage? Go damage. Holy light, immaculate heart, or scapular. Immaculate heart, 20% damage up. It's really, really good. And I wonder what it would do with the orbiting spectral tier. But I also want to see what holy light's going to do. Come on. Bone spurs. We got sci-fly. Consolation prize. We can just see that it's going to give me speed up. That's lame as hell. Stapler. Try to go for spun. Pact. Eye of the Occult. I kind of want to... I love Pact, by the way. It's really, really good. But I want to see what Eye of the Occult is going to do, if anything. I also want to see if we can maybe marbles gulp some trinkets. 
Oh, crystal key. What's this new one? Mom's grief. Save Isaac from lethal damage once. Gives three broken hearts and disappears when triggered. That's that's really cool. I like that. What I also like, though, is Book of Virtues. Oh, man. Star of Bethlehem could be so funny. I gotta say no to the Holy Mantle. I'm going Star of Bethlehem. Dunce Cap? I gotta know. I have to know what's gonna happen. Book of Virtues Void. That could be really interesting for the final floor. Get some range, I guess. More tech? I'm interested. Probably gonna go Angelic Prism again here. It sounds just more funky. Monstrance could be cool. And that's it. Okay, we did not get God Ed or Sacred Heart back, but I really can't complain right now. And I forgot there's two more items that are gonna be in this chest because we are technically on the chest. I guess I'll just eat them. Okay, look at this. Look at this. Holy light! When I slam the ground, it, it brings down light on me. What are these gonna do? What the heck? Oh, that's right. I can steer them around because Eye of the Occult. This run is just completely unhinged. All right, we're back. Let's see how good it is. I don't even know what's happening, but I'm pretty sure it's good. <laughs> we got gems down here in the chest. That's that's kind of cool. Buddy, you are like directly in my way. Do you realize that? Gold bar, baby. 99%. You doing all right, buddy? Hmm? He's like, no, Isaac, give me attention. Boop, 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 boop. Too powerful. This is too powerful. Mom's bra. No thanks. If I throw the rocks through the prism, does it? Oh my gosh. <laughs> that looks so ridiculous. Let's do that when we walk into this room. Oh, love it. Hey, we find our ultra secret room. Hope it's got something good. Bloody gust. I'll take that. And it's got the cube of meat. Yeah. Voidable, I'd say. Or a range upgrade. Luck is nice, though. Higher chest chances for higher luck. Oh, just turning everybody into shredded lettuce. It's not even fair. Mega chest. I get these so frequently. Yes to Jacob's Ladder. Eat the fly for damage. Dog tooth. Wait, what? How are you howling? Are you howling in this room? Oh, oh, there we go. <laughs> I was so confused for a second. Are you having fun right now? This is what I'm seeing right now. This is what I see. This is me trying to play the game. Hey. Buddy. Final boss. Let's see how quickly we can do this. Yep, pretty quickly. You think I'm gonna skip Mega Satan? Because I'm not. Got something to say to you, Mega Satan. Oh, our Star of Bethlehem. I totally forgot. It went into the Mega Satan room. Let's go! <laughs> Look at these punches! Oh my goodness. 35 damage as well. I, this is, wow, holy crap. Oh ho ho ho! Oh ho ho ho! Just the sound effects. This is a bad kung fu movie. And I love, I love all of it. I am here for it. And Mega Satan, guess who's got a golden bar? Sci-Fly, you're worth it. Every penny. Got him. That was beautiful. Absolutely amazing. Completely unhinged run. Let me know your thoughts on Tarnished Samson. I very much so enjoyed that. Sometimes you can have these new characters that just like have too many rules, too many things going on to really understand how to appropriately use them. This one, very straightforward and very satisfying. Once again, love to hear your thoughts on it. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you in the next one.